The name of this tutorial is Smoke Simulation Blender 2.50 Alpha Zero Tutorial. Smoke Simulation is a neat new feature in Blender 2.50. If you're familiar with Blender's particle system and the fluid simulation, you should have no problem with blowing smoke in Blender 2.5. To make the smoke render, you need to create a volume type material and add a voxel data texture. These are new as well. I will demonstrate how to make smoke from start to the final rendering. I'll point out the new settings which you can play with. Please post your renders on YouTube as video comments. Let's have a little smoke simulator competition. By the way, you can download the latest 2.5 Alpha Zero version of Blender from Blender.org. Since the developers are constantly making changes, make sure you get the latest and greatest version. So let's get started. Start with the default cube. Scale it four times. S for enter. The large cube will be our domain, the area in which the smoke is generated. Press the Z key to go into wireframe mode so we can see inside the cube. Then add a UV sphere within the domain. Shift A, mesh, UV sphere. The UV sphere will generate the smoke particles. Select the cube. Select the physics tab all the way to the right. Scroll down until you see the smoke section. Click the arrow, click add, enable smoke, and click domain. Now select the UV sphere, click add, click flow, and go to the particles tab next and click the plus sign to add a particle system. It's called particle system by default. Accept the default. Of course, you can tweak all the particle system settings later to make the smoke go wherever you want. So go back to the Physics tab and the Smoke section. Enter the particle system name under the particle system. Press Alt-A to animate. We can see smoke coming out of the sphere. We're not done yet. Press F12 to render. Only the cube renders. To get the smoke to actually render, you need to add a material and texture to the cube domain in a new way. So select the cube domain, add a material, click volume. Play around with the transmission, scattering, emission color, transmission color, and reflection color settings. I set these to some arbitrary values. I'm sure you can make much better smoke than I can. Go to the texture section, add a texture, select voxel data, make the domain cube. Press F12 to render. You can go on to animating by selecting the video type, MOV, AVI codec, AVI uncompressed, and set the number of frames. Then click the animation buttons. Now they, they spell the word out in full. Isn't that something? And wait. I'm excited to see what kind of great smoke you can make. If you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to hit the big subscribe button on YouTube. Happy blendering!